Hello there my light-hearted peeps, the My Love Island fans. Yeah, I just had to kind of say something about tonight. I didn't say anything about the other last couple of days because there was nothing major, but Rebecca coming into the house has really shown people up for who they are. Really. I, I mean, she is extremely attractive. I like her style. She's very mature. And I just like her. Um, you know what I don't like though? I don't like the way Sophie handled herself. It was all, well, I shouldn't say I don't like the way she handled herself really. I guess um, the thought of losing Connor, number one, um, made her realise that she had to go after him and realise that she didn't really like Connor with a G. But did you see Shanice's face yesterday? when Rebecca came into the dance place and, you know, kind of danced and flirted with the guys, her face was a picture. And so now, I don't know, Shanice really likes um, Connor with the G, but I've got a funny feeling Rebecca is going to choose him. But what do you think about Shauna? Has she got a low self-esteem or what? Is she always going to be happy to be second best? I mean, that Callum has given her no reassurance at all. And I don't know if they've edited it or what, but bloody hell. If I had a guy looking at me like that, as bland as arseholes, and nothing at all, you're not getting nothing from him, I would I can't be asked. I mean, where is she going with him? I mean, they've been there, what, like two or three days? And nothing. All he says is, when she said, oh, um, do you think you're going to like her then? And he just says, oh, well, I don't know. Do you know no little, I mean, the irony is, is that when he was, with um, Rebecca, he actually said he was happy with Shauna, but his behaviour doesn't say that. And I don't know whether he's, you know, wearing his heart on his sleeve and he's not sure how to um, play the game, because it is a game. Maybe he doesn't know how to play the game. Maybe he is one of these people who is just allowing things to happen to him. And he feels as though he doesn't have to put any effort. And you know those fatalists, you know those people who think whatever will be, will be. That's what it's like. It's almost like he is just waiting for things to happen. If Rebecca chooses him, he'll go with her. If she doesn't, he'll stay with Shauna. But you know, how do they progress into a relationship that way on the island? They can't. Connor, number one, I think he's really, he's really, really good. I mean, he's, I'm really beginning to like him, to be honest. At first, I thought he was a bunny boiler, but he is just so cool and direct and open and the way he spoke to Rebecca, I mean, look how beautiful she is. And he is technically single. He could have easily said to her, look, you know, I'm single. I'm up for grabs. But no, he said he wanted um, Sophie. And unless she says no, he's not available. I mean, you can't get better than that, can you? So now we have um, the picking tomorrow. I can't wait. To see who Rebecca picks. I'm praying that she um, picks Tall Connor. I really do pray that she picks him. I, for some reason, I don't want Shanice to get him. I don't know. There's something about her. I don't know what it is. But I don't want her to get him. But I, I wouldn't mind Rebecca getting him. I don't want Rebecca to choose Callum. He's a wet fish. And I don't know what the woman's seeing him. I mean, he's hardly got any vocabulary. He's just, he's just dull. And I don't get it. Not unless they're editing it out, like I said, and making him deliberately uninteresting. Because he's definitely uninteresting. And I don't even think he's all that good looking. As for Mike, I don't know where Mike's head is at. Oh, when Shauna kissed him and said he's the biggest game player. I mean... To be honest, 
I did have my, I, I did think about that only because when they were going out on that date yesterday with Leanne, I think his reaction was over the top. It was definitely OTT. You're going on a bloody date for Christ's sake. And then it's like he's always saying these questions as though he's trying to um, um, pull her out. Like when he says, oh, would you, um, would you, would you like to be a wag? And then he goes back and says to the guys, oh, I really think she's into me. Yeah, I think she's really what she really wants it to progress. Now, I don't know whether by asking her if she wanted to be a wag and all she said is who wouldn't. I don't know whether he's just looking for reassurance himself. I don't get it. But, you know, I... <laughs> Is he a game player? Has he been watching the show before? And he wants to be the one who gives advice to everyone. He wants to be the daddy. You know what I mean? I don't know. I don't want him to be a game player. But his behaviour sometimes is a bit... Mm, it's a bit questionable. So we'll just have to see. I'd like to think he's really into Leanne. But I still got a funny feeling... The woman comes in there and she and she um she picks him. I just think, you know, some of them have said in the past, please don't pick me. They have said that when they're really into someone. So it'd be interesting to see if a girl comes in there who actually picks him. If Rebecca had picked him, he'd be gone. It's only because she weren't interested in him. I I don't know. I would really, I would have not, I, I want to believe that it's genuine and sincere, but still not convinced. But that's just me kind of maybe um, putting little pinholes into it, scrutinising it too much. So I don't really know. It's hard. I, it really seems as though he's into her. And then sometimes I just think, is he really into her? But we'll just have to see. You see, with with Connor, number one Connor, you can tell he's into um, Sophie. You can just tell. Not only by him, um, by his actions and the way he behaves, but he's so cool. And I love the way he stepped back. He could have behaved, the way he was behaving before, he could have behaved in such a maniacal way with Sophie when she was with Connor but he was just so cool so yeah props to Connor I think you know Connor number one I still like Connor number two I think um he just needs some the right woman to bring him out of himself but I think he's probably quite a nice guy um and I think I don't think there's anybody really um that kind of stood out for me tonight to be honest so yeah, that bloody Callum better would take somebody special. Was it him that said that? For him to jump ship. Yeah, I just think Shauna needs to get some self-esteem. Honestly, she's behaving like she's a ma like she's a maniac. Really, I mean, he's gone off with one woman. He's gone off with another. He comes back. What does she see in him? But maybe she's just got a connection. But I think, you know, she's she's always going to be second best if that's the case. She now needs for a lovely bloke to come in, like Connor, Connor, Connor with a G, and that she really likes. But there again, she's so into Callum. They're obviously not showing us the real story. They're obviously missing out bits because I don't get it. Anyway, that's all I wanted to share with you this evening. You're probably, <coughs> but hey, it's just my opinion. Bye-bye.